BB Tales. BB Tales. BB Tales. BB Tales. So now we are back with the couple where one told the other he was gonna die. So, question number one. Two events from your, about your significant other that you remember perfectly. Last weekend, we went and house sat for his uncle. It was just one of those like, crazy bonding moments because we were just doing homework and we got to see what it's like to interact without the whole dorm and school life and just get away from like a really stressful week. I remember the Change Records concert pretty well. Uh, that was such a fun time. I got to know her like, you know, in her happiest state and stuff like that. So that was really clear in my mind. The second one was over the summer. I like to like listen to a lot of music and everything, especially on Spotify. He's like, oh cool, like why don't you send me some of those? I was like, really? Like shut up, stop. I did and uh, one day I was on my Spotify thing and you could say like, who's following you and stuff and he had actually made a playlist called Boss of the Day. It was all the songs I had sent him from like a couple weeks. So I almost like, so oh my gosh, it was, it was awesome. How long have you two been together now? It's been about a little over five months. What was your biggest argument? The one time that we really got into, I guess, an argument is um, we were going to dinner and I was trying to tell him about my day. I was starting to tell a story. Well, in the middle of my story, our good friend was like, hey, John Michael, like, look at this. And John Michael, like, looks away and completely forgets I'm talking to him. So he goes and puts his plate up, comes back, and I'm like, well, now do you want to hear my story? He's like, oh, yeah. So I finished and I had, like, two seconds left and they were both like, that's all you had to say? After dinner, he was like, are you okay? I was like, no, like, I'm mad. And he goes, well, let's talk about it. So we talked about it, we, we resolved it. He felt really bad about it, so, yeah. So I like PCs. She likes Macs. So this this was, I was like, PCs are better than Macs, you know? Like, there's nothing about it. But it wasn't like, like yelling at each other, but it was pretty chill. What is your biggest pet peeve about your significant other? It's kind of like, she has bad OCD and I have bad OCD too, but like I kind of got over it, but she, she has it bad now and sometimes she like picks at her skin even though she doesn't need to and like, it like, you know, like makes little, like little like blood spots and stuff and I'm like, no, stop doing that, like your skin's fine, but yeah. He doesn't bother me much, Dinner it a lot of the times, but if there's two things that bother me, he doesn't like to time manage. Like when we're walking, he's a fast walker, I'm a slow walker, and he tends to walk ahead of me, like four or five feet ahead of me, I'm like, wait up, and yeah, he's a fast walker, he doesn't manage his time well. What are your three favorite characteristics about John Michael? He's, he's just very mature. And he treats people with just the utmost respect. Like, if you mention to him, like, hey, you know, like, I had a test this day, you know, two days later after you take the test, he'll ask me, like, oh, how is that test going? Um, he's really good just dealing with me, because I have, you know, I deal with a lot of anxiety issues, and he doesn't leave until he, you know, makes sure that I'm okay. So he's very caring, very thoughtful. He's just a very rare person to come by. One of the characteristics I like about her is that she can go into any room and just like light up everyone's faces. Second thing is if you're feeling sad or whatever, she will do anything she can to make you feel better. Third thing is she's good at planning. So like if there's a trip or anything, if you really like you want to do it, she will plan it with you step by step, you know? Yeah, I really like that. Where do you see yourself in John Michael in five years? Well, I'll still be in school. He would have already been working, I want to say, for two years. Um, definitely still see us together and just taking every day one day at a time, but definitely like together and happy. Possibly married, see her having her master's degree in speech pathology or audiology. Um, I see me having um, a solid mechanical engineering job. We want a husky, so I guess I see us having a husky. Maybe getting our first house. Yeah.